Good afternoon. Some of the brightest minds in nuclear energy are gathered in Albuquerque today, and the talk is about expanding operations at WIP. Research is extensive, and they're discussing whether salt could be used to store high-level waste there. It comes just weeks after a radioactive leak that has people living nearby on edge. News 13's Cole Miller is live in Uptown, where today's meeting is still going on. Cole? Yeah, Kim, this is drawing a lot of interest, especially because of ongoing concerns over that recent radioactive leak at the WIP site. Now, that's the Waste Isolation Pilot Plant that sits 26 miles outside of the southeastern New Mexico town of Carlsbad and on top of massive salt beds. Currently, the plant handles only low-level nuclear waste. The review board is looking at salt as a possible safe storehouse for higher-level waste and spent nuclear fuel. It's important to note this meeting is not to solely discuss WIP. Chair of the board, Rodney Ewing, says a professor at Stanford, says they're weighing the pros and the cons of salt as a medium to contain that higher-level waste. He says salt shows positive characteristics when it comes to high-level waste. If it has a very positive list of, pos of uh, good qualities, uh, that would apply to salt deposits around the country, including those in the Carlsbad area. Energy experts here in New Mexico have differing opinions over possible expansion at WIP. Senators uh, Martin Heinrich and Tom Udall are both opposed to uh, expansion and higher level waste being stored at the plant. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Cole. Now, the Department of Energy is still monitoring the radiation levels following last month's leak. Public comment at today's meeting is scheduled to begin at 445 this afternoon.